Um, this is absolutely true, this, okay? I don't often have live studio guests. I'm trying to think. I've probably had four in about the last three or four years. It's quite amazing. Tonight, I've got one, okay? And I like this one because I've had him on the phone a couple of times, but now I've got him in the studio. He was born in Baghdad, but was taught to box in Canning Town. The journey from Iraq to East London was long and hazardous. He's an entertaining heavyweight. He hasn't had a lot of breaks, but he may just, may just be turning that corner and going somewhere different now. It's a delight to welcome to the show Ali Adams. Ali, thanks for coming in. Thank you very much, Steve. Thank you for inviting me here. No, listen, it's always a pleasure to have you in. I mean, you, it's fair to say that, you, you know, you, you, you're, just getting your, you're just getting your stuff in order now, aren't you? Just yeah. getting it together now. Definitely, just getting it together. You know, just, I just you know, I, as you know, you know, I changed promotion and I changed trainer. Yep. You know, I'm with Don Charles in the yep. moment. Yep. And, yep. you know, he's been training me, like, you know, for the last two months. And it's unbelievable. I've never been confident in my life like how I feel today, you oh, know, okay. just, it's like, he showed me the right technique, he showed me the right fitness, he got me the, the fitness, you know, I never used to be fit like that before, you know, now I could do 10, I, I just done 8 rounds today, 10 rounds actually, you know, 10 rounds sparring and today. And you can spar, and obviously Derek, you spar with Derek. I spar with Derek, yeah, of course, Chizor, Derek, Derek's got my deal for your entire, exactly, and you know, we are fighting the same day, you know, oh, it's like, oh, unfortunately, oh, your 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 call is in Helsinki. That's right, you know, just like, un unfortunately, in the same day, and I'm, I'm not, not in, like, uh, uh, he has to be, you know, in, in, in there, so he can't be with me, Don Charles. So, so we've been sparring. Like you know, sparring is going very well. Like you know, the fitness is going very well. Technical going amazing. Like you know, it's oh. everything getting you know in place. Ali, how old were you when you left uh, Iraq? Uh, Fifteen years old. And, and you done it, were you boxing at the time? Had you boxed in Iraq? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was boxing. I was boxing in Iraq. You know, I was boxing like amateur and junior okay. and stuff. Like you know, like a like a little like school boys sure. and stuff. And I've done a few fights and everything. And But the technique, you know, the boxing in Iraq is completely different than here. When I came here, you know, when I went to All Stars Gym, you know, yep. um, uh, amateur gym, and then it was it was completely, they changed my style, you know, because we used to, like, upside down, like, they changed me upside down. So, yeah, to turn you around Yeah, turn me around, you know, so I had to start from again, from zero, you know. Oh. And, uh, yeah, so, so again, again. So, I mean, you're not, you're not a baby, you're 30, but you're, you're relatively fresh in boxing years, yeah, Ali. Yeah. I mean, um, do, do, how, I mean, realistically, where do you think you can go now? I mean, now that you've got this new, this new lease of life from Don Charles, you're, you're all inspired, you know, you all, I mean, you, you had a bad draw in the prize fight, you ended yeah. up drawing Matt Skelton, Matt Skelton. He, still, he still gave it a go, yeah. you know, and he'd been yeah. the British champion, Commonwealth champion, of course. for the world title. Of you course, were... all the respect to Mark Skelton, you know, just, uh, uh, basically, uh, like, uh, we just offered him a fight, you know, for to fight this on the, oh, yeah. on the 3rd of December, you know, he said we no. offered him, he said, uh, I don't know, for some reason, he didn't want to take the fight, you know. Well, I think he thinks he can probably bounce to a title fight, yeah. or a big, a, no disrespect to you, but a bigger fight. Yeah, yeah, no, but we offered him a good money and stuff, and, you oh, know, wow. but he, he turned it down and stuff, and, uh, yeah. Um... To be honest, Steve, you know, just my dream to get the world title, you know, since I was a very young age, you know, like dream to get to the world title, to get to be a world champion. Oh. And now, you know, with Don Charles and, and the training I'm getting and, and the confidence I've got is like, I feel it is, is, is I could see it, you know, I could see it's coming. It, uh, can people follow you? Do you have a Twitter or anything? Or, or I've got or, Facebook. What's, Facebook. Your, what's, your, what's your Facebook? Just, 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 just Ali Adams. Ali, just Ali, Ali, Adams. Ali Adams. Yeah. So if you want to see Ali, you've got some of your clips of your fights Yeah, on yeah, there. fights, uh, everything. You so know. if you want to see Ali, uh, not in the flesh, obviously, because I'm only seeing him in the flesh, you're listening <laughs> to him. If you want to watch him, you can go to his Facebook site. So you fight on December the 3rd. Uh, is that just a normal... Uh, and where, uh, where do you go after? We you fight in we January? Fight, yeah, you've been, oh, we've been offered uh, uh, for the WBC, the silver title. Yeah, you know? that's not bad. Yeah, yeah, exactly, in Germany. And the British Boxing Board didn't allow me to go because I've never done eight or ten rounds okay, before. Okay, so you're doing an eight rounder here. So exactly, we don't know. I'm doing eight, ten rounder for international. Oh, I'm oh, fighting cool. international title on the third of December. Yeah. And then that qualified me to to the WBC World Title. You know, hopefully early next year. Which is a silver title, and then you move on. Definitely. Yeah. You move on. From, oh, listen, I'm delighted for you. I'm delighted for you, Ali, because you had a, you've, had, you've had a long old journey to get here. From yeah, Iraq, yeah, and it hasn't yeah. been easy, has it? It was it was very very as, difficult. Believe me, I've I've had a really difficult and hard time. You know. Especially when I came here as well, like, you know, I didn't speak English. Uh, uh, I had to study, I had to work, I had to box. You know, I had nobody, to, nobody no one support me, you know. So I'd done everything by my hand. And it was really hard for me, you know. It's a really, really difficult and I've had a really hard time. But, you know, just, it's like, uh, you know, I'm a man and I have to, you know, have to... Depend. Step up. Can't, yeah, step up and, and do something in this life, exactly. No, no you've been, you went back to Iraq. Uh, I know it was under great circumstances. Yeah, yeah. To, 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 to for your father's... Yeah, my yeah, father's death, father, yeah. father's death, so it wasn't away. great. Uh, but are you, have you been back since? No, 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 so this is the last time. Just you know, I haven't been since then, like, you know, 13 years. 
oh, and wow. then then the, went back then. Uh, I was, yeah, I was even called. They saying you know f- your father in coma, so I had to travel straight away okay. in the same day, and I was with him in the hospital for a week. Well, that's good. And then yeah, exactly. So At least that, some, you know, it's not great, but it's right. better. Yeah, yeah, than yeah not better than, there. That's right. And then you know, then he passed away. It was a big loss, and you know, it was a big emotional to me. Like, is is like you know, it, it kind of a little depressed me and damaged me a tiny bit. It's like a. And then you know, just uh, after that, like you know, then uh, I didn't. I haven't then you been have to push on. Yeah, you, I to push on. exactly. You, you're, you know, everyone, everyone. I mean, I've seen you box a few times now, and, it, and what strikes me is that even when you're up against it, like against the skeleton, you still remain positive. Yeah, definitely. It was like the worst yeah, possible yeah, exactly. draw. It was, it, fighter, yeah, exactly. But you smiled like you're doing exactly. now. Exactly, exactly. Uh, <laughs> listen, Ali, it's been a pleasure talking to you. December the 3rd, Ali Adams is fighting. If you want to go and see him at York Hall, I'm sure the tickets are about 35 quid. And and you can go onto his Facebook site, which is Ali Adams, and find him. He's the uh, He's the big, big heavyweight. Uh, who's based in... Whereabouts are you based in London now? Where do we say I, you're based I, from? I live in Chelsea. Live in Chelsea? Yeah. Go on, son. Are you a Chelsea fan? <laughs> Chelsea fan, definitely. You're a Chelsea fan. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to say thank you to Steve and uh, Olivia Goodwin, you know, for the, for for the promotion they've been doing. Yeah, putting me... Like, you know, I've signed with them now. Oh, good. And then, you know, just like they've been doing amazing work, you know? Steve and Olivia, they've been doing... Olivia's um, the youngest promoter yeah, in the young, country. Exactly, She's exactly. About 22 years of age or something. That's right, yeah. Now, I don't want to show. Been, I don't want to show. Yeah, they've been doing an amazing job and, you know, the publicity, everything is just, just going on. Right, you know, well, you're on this show. Yeah, I'm on this show. show. Exactly, so exactly. Right? I'm with Steve. Ali, Thank you very much, It's been Steve. a pleasure. That's Thanks Ali Adams thank there. Thank you. Thank you. We got. Uh,